Hello my workout buddies, welcome to this week's workout. Today we're doing a super fun workout similar to the format from last week where we're gonna be doing a hit cardio section followed by a strength section. So today what we're doing is a six minute uh, core focused hit cardio section followed by uh, three different strength exercises for our legs and our booty. And we're gonna do three sets or three rounds of both sections. And then at the end, we're going to finish it off with a crazy, horrible little Tabata section. So that should be really fun. Um, for this workout, you'll need a few things. So okay, first of all, um, if you only have dumbbells, you can totally do this workout. But if you also have a stability ball like that, grab that. If you don't have that, uh, grab a pillow. You can just substitute a pillow and if you have bands go get your bands um, If you don't have bands, then we will you can use um, your dumbbells for it So get a cup couple different sets of dumbbells You'll need something a little bit heavier and a bit lighter as well for a few different things uh, If you have a kettlebell grab that uh, we're doing kettlebell swings But if you don't have a kettlebell just use a dumbbell a heavier one um, And yeah, I think that's all I need to tell you about that um, so we're gonna do a warm-up together. So go get your equipment and let's get to the warm-up and let's get going All right guys, let's get warmed up. I'm gonna start my timer If you did my workout with me last week uh, We're doing the same warm-up because it's effective and simple and I'm too lazy to think of a new warm-up. So Just uh, Bear with me. So start off with doing jumping jacks it's a four minute warm up plus uh, 20 glute bridges. So it's gonna go by fairly quickly. Just nice easy jacks, get the heart rate up. Warm everything up. Have your uh, lightweight handy. We're moving on to a core rotation with a squat, I think. Yeah. Squat and core rotation for the next interval. Good. Okay, grab your light weight. Ready? Feet facing forward. Squat. Sorry, squat with it down and rotate. Brace the core. Make sure you're only moving one foot. The other foot is staying facing the front. Brace the core. Feel the glutes turn on. Fifteen seconds left. Good. Drop the weight. All right. It's three way, no, four way lunges. Right leg. Lunge forward. Lateral, reverse, and curtsy. Repeat, front, side, back, and curtsy. Keep the core braced while you do this. Getting those legs ready. We're gonna work them today. You guys know it's my favorite thing to do, right? Legs and booty, it's the best. Good. Now we're gonna switch to the other side. And let's go. Just 
few more. Keep it going. Ten seconds left. Okay. Nice work. Now let's let's get on the ground for 20 glute bridges. So we're just doing this to activate our booty a bit more so that when we do our strength exercises, we're really gonna be feeling it in our tush and able to actually grow muscle there. Okay, so brace your core and you're gonna just push up with your hips, squeeze your glutes at the top. Don't let go, squeeze up and all the way down. 20 reps, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Good job. All right, so I'm gonna grab a towel and get my water filled up and we're gonna move on to our hit cardio section. Okay guys, I hope you're feeling good, nice and warm. We are going to get started with our cardio now. So the first exercise is gonna be kettlebell swing. So either grab your kettlebell or your dumbbell and let's get to it. Six minutes. That's it. It's going to get a little crazy, but it's only six minutes, okay? So you can do it. All right. Feet wide apart and push forward with your hips. It's a hip hinge. Keep your core tight. Squeeze your glutes. more seconds. Okay. All right. Get down on the floor. We're doing plank jack with shoulder tap. Easier version of this is just to um, either just do the feet or just do the arms. But if you want, do both. Brace your core though. And you can go as slow or as fast as you want. Eighteen seconds left. I think you can see what I'm doing. 
Getting the heart rate way up there. Land softly on that tuck jump. Oh, you can get a break after this. Okay. 
All right, so for squats, if you don't have the bands, you're gonna hold your weight and you're gonna do front squats, goblet squats with your weight. And you're gonna send your hips back and then bend at the knee. Just like this, okay? You guys know how to squat, right? You do. Okay, and kickbacks. So if you don't have the bands, this is what you're gonna do. You are going to do donkey kicks. So the whole time we're doing kickbacks, you're just going to be pulsing it up. Donkey kicks, really activating your glutes and your core. You're really gonna feel it burn in your booty. Okay guys, so let's get started. We're gonna be doing deadlifts first. So we're doing 15 reps of each exercise. Okay. So banded, you're gonna put the band underneath your feet and make sure you grab somewhere Make sure you grab low enough down so that it's, you're feeling, you know, some resistance, obviously. Just like this. Okay, you guys ready? Let's go for 15 reps. One. Two. Three. Uh, if you keep your knees a lot more straight, you're gonna feel it more in your hamstrings. Five. I think that's what I'm gonna do. Six. Squeeze your booty on the way up. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. All right, good work. Okay, next up, front squats. So again, we're gonna step on the band. Your feet are gonna be a bit wider this time. And come down and grab, grab the band. And let me just fix my shorts here. And just, just gonna do regular front squats, go. I find I can't go far as far back doing the front squats or as far down, but that's okay. Okay, you guys ready? 15 reps. All right, let's do it. One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, so I fall backwards. Nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, and 15. Oh, okay, you know what? Honestly, I think I'm gonna use my kettlebell next round. So I felt my back getting super tight. I don't know. I don't love the front squats with the band. But you guys try it and let me know what you think. 
Okay, kickbacks. So, secure the band behind one foot. Ugh. And arms like this. And let's go. One, kicking straight back. Two, three. You know what? I don't think this is really red. This band seems kind of easy. Whatever. I'll just do the easy band for this one. I'll try the harder one next time. Three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four. And five. <sighs> okay, switching legs. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three. Four and five. All right. Good job. Grab some water. Have a quick rest. We're done round one. Moving on to round two. Okay. Round two coming at you. Press and start. Get your kettlebell or your dumbbell. We're starting with kettlebell swings. Shoulders back and down, toes pointed slightly out, lock the core, push through with your hips. Squeeze your booty every time. Uh, 
Lunge it. Tuck. Lunge. Star jump. Option. Lunge and squat. Lunge and squat again. Line soft. Big star jumps, come on. Nice work. Okay. Tricep burpees. Come down, knee, arms are straight, or sorry, arms are narrow, elbows going straight back. guys. Round two of cardio is complete. Now we're going to get right into those strength exercises. Ready y'all? Grab your band or your dumbbells and Let's do those deadlifts. Remember, you really want to keep your back flat and you're just hinging at your hips, sending your hips back as if you're going to put something down on the floor and then pick it up. Push forward with your hips, squeeze your glutes. Ready? 15. One. Two, three, 
four, five, <laughs> six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Great work, you guys. Squats. Okay. Like I said, I'm going to use my kettlebell now because I didn't really care for the front squats. You can totally tell that I don't practice these workouts before I do them. <laughs> right? It's like, I come up with it, I'm like, yeah, that looks like fun, let's try that. And I just try it for the first time on camera. Maybe I shouldn't do that, maybe I should prepare more, but whatevs. Okay. Feet a little wider apart, toes slightly turned out. Send your hips back and squat down. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two. Three, four, five. Whew. Great. And, you know, ever since I started doing these glute activation things, I can actually feel my butt when I'm squatting. Like before, I would just do squats, and I would just feel it all in my quads and my hamstrings. So if you just did those squats and you didn't feel it in your booty, you just felt it in your quads, then um, you should do, I have a video titled How to Activate Your Glutes. You should check it out. Okay, remember, if you don't have the bands, you're doing donkey kicks here, okay? So, let's go. One, two, Three, four, five, six, brace the core, seven, oh yeah, I'm feeling this, oh, eight, nine, ten, one, Two, oh gosh, three, four, oh, five. Whoo! All right, switch legs. I always think that these are going to be easy. They're a little more challenging than they look, right? Okay. Same thing, other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, oh my gosh, nine, Ten, five more. One, 
two, three, four, and five. Yeah. Uh, I'm dripping with sweat, you guys. How are you doing? Okay, grab some water, towel off, quick rest, round three coming at ya. Okay guys, it's approaching that point in the workout where my face is super red and I'm covered in sweat and I just look done. But we have one more round left, okay? So let's do our last six minutes of our cardio core. Grab your kettlebell or your dumbbell. We're doing swings, shoulders back and down. Hinge at your hips. Push that butt back, squeeze. We're halfway. Almost there, guys. Come on. Great job. Oh no, plank jack, shoulder tap. Oh, okay, we're doing it. Brace that core. Try not to let your hips rock and rotate. Keep everything solid. Keep it up. 
Brace the core. Get the knees all the way up. Point your toes. This is it. Last time through for these. Come on. We got 20 seconds left. Can you speed it up? Just a touch. Just a tad. Come on. Let's go. Five. Great. Grab your pillow or your ball. Nine, ten, 
11, 12, 1, 2, 3, awesome, okay, donkey kicks, or, uh, what are these things called, kickbacks, <laughs> something kick, okay, you guys ready, 15 reps, 1, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, oh my God. okay, last set. One, two, three. Okay, something feels a little weird. Hang on, guys, sorry. Let me just fix this. Okay, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Nine, ten, five more. One. Two, three, four, and five. Oh my god. Ah, uh, fail. Ouch. Actually, that didn't really hurt that much. Okay. Ugh. Okay, guys, quick rest. Towel off. We're almost done the workout. All we have left is four minutes of Tabata, so. Take about a minute break, pause the video, and we'll be back for the finisher. All right, guys, time for the Tabata finisher. This is gonna suck, I'm sorry. Sorry in advance, this is gonna be like brutal, okay? Uh, I'm not pro promising any kind of like heroic performance here because it's gonna be ridiculous. Okay, but just, you know, do the best you can. We're doing jugglers and switch lunges, alternating. Yeah, it's gonna be great. <laughs> Okay, we're starting with jugglers. I don't think I've done these since like February, so <laughs> we'll see how I do. If that's too much for you, just uh, you can just do high knees if you want. But it's, you know, two high knees, tap, tap. One, two, tap, tap. Brace the core. Good. Right into switch lunges. Get ready, guys. And go. Brace that core. Good. Okay. Back to jugglers. 
that heart rate it's gonna be way up let's go brace the core lift those knees Switch lunges. Did the rest just get shorter? Seems like it. If you're crazy, you lift up your arms for even more cardio fun. Jugglers. Do you hate me yet? Oh. No, but you will now. Brace the core. Come on. Five seconds. Do it. Go. Switch lunges. Arms up, if you want. Three, two, one, rest. Last two, push. This is it, you can do it, okay? Go. Don't think, just go, just go. You're doing it. You did it. Nice work. Switch lunges. This is it, last. Last 20 seconds, arms up. Give me your best. Switch lunges. All the way to the end. Go. This is it. Five, four, three, two, one. We did it. Holy. Catch your breath. Nice work, you guys. Have some water. <sighs> yeah. I like putting the Tabata finisher in there. It really gets you going right at the end. Makes you feel like you really use up everything you had. I was feeling really energetic and strong today. So I thought, yeah, Tabata finisher, we need it. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, if you like working out with me and you want more workouts, I do have some programs available. You can check them out in the description below. I have one free one, it's called Jumpstart. Click the link in the description and you can check out my other two programs as well. If you want to weigh in on future workouts, you can support me on Patreon. And I think that's it. That's my spiel for today. Okay, you guys. Thanks for working out with me. Had fun, hope you had fun. And I'll see you in the next video. Mwah. Bye.